What's up everybody and welcome to Hammerdown Motorsports. Today we are in the Christmas spirit and we are going to deliver some gifts. Thank you to everybody who entered the giveaway. We have all three of our winners. We have one in Utah, one in Missouri, and we have one right here in Ephrata, Pennsylvania. So I'm going to be delivering it personally. <laughs> Well everybody, we are nearing the end of December here and we're kind of losing daylight. It's kind of a hard thing for YouTubers, especially us with day jobs. We can't vlog during the day because we have other things going on. And we kind of got to take what time we have in the evening and pretty much it's dark right away. So apologize for the lighting. I do have a light on my other rig, so if I'm walking around I can use that. Kind of helps out a little bit, but we'll get through it and it will be summertime before we know it and I can't wait for all that because we have so much coming up this year with the cars and the events. Speaking of that, we are going to Camaro Fest 8. If those of you who already knew, we went to Camaro Fest 7 and a bunch of people were there. Camaro people, Lethal Camaro was there and the whole California crew. And uh, this year's gonna be even bigger as a bunch of people already confirmed to go. So I'm very excited about that. We hopefully will have another big power mod for the Camaro. I'm working on that as we speak. There's two directions I can go, and it's really going to depend on a couple of manufacturers of whether they want to be a part of the build or not, and uh, that's when the decision is going to be made. Another thing I've been reading in the comment section is people wondering who I am, and that's something I kind of didn't really realize, because when you have a smaller channel, a lot of times people just watch your channel for your car mods or information purposes, DIY, stuff like that. They aren't exactly interested in the vlogger themselves until you get a little bit bigger and they get a little bit more invested in who you are. So I just decided I'm gonna do a little bit about me in some of the vlogs and give you guys some more information about me, myself, and, and what I'm all about. So first thing I wanted to mention is I am from Canada in case anybody didn't already know I'm from the province of Alberta the last place I lived in Canada was Fort McMurray Alberta which is the home of the oil sands and I worked in the mining industry up there for a little over six years actually the last place I worked was uh, finning which is a big caterpillar dealership and I worked on all kinds of heavy equipment and heavy haulers and Basically the biggest stuff you're gonna see as far as what Caterpillar makes other than maybe something in the marine industry or something like that But we worked on like 797s and we worked on dozers and graders and Pretty much anything they used out in the mines and it was a great experience Weather up there is pretty extreme. We get pretty extreme hots and pretty extreme colds and uh, I remember starting up my car at minus 27 Fahrenheit and uh, Basically, if you took a boiling pot of water when it's really cold up there and throw it up in the air, it will freeze before it hits the ground, if that's any kind of indication of how cold it really does get up there. But it was a great experience. I had a lot of fun up there, met a lot of really good people. And it's kind of fun to work in an industry where not a lot of people have the guts to leave their comfort zone and actually go out and work in that environment because it is very different. And a lot of people uh, would travel because it was a two week on, two week off shift. So you could live pretty much anywhere in the world and then do that job. But over time, it just kind of wore on me having to do the travel every month. I had to fly across the country every month twice. So it, it kind of, uh, yeah, wore on me a lot, especially with relationships and things like that. You miss so much when you're gone for two weeks at a time. And I just decided four years ago it was time to move to Pennsylvania to live here where my wife is from and uh, we started a family and things have been great working for myself doing my own service truck thing and then I got into YouTube and it's really grown a lot from there I've met a lot of new people and very talented and skilled people in the, the more performance end of things and I just can't wait to see where it goes from here so talking about 2018 I do have a little bit of a sneak peek for everybody we are going to be doing a few things in a couple different ways. We're not going to be doing just necessarily Camaro things, although we will be doing a lot of Camaro things this year. We have bought the little Coleman mini bike, if anybody has seen that video. It was the best uh, Christmas gift for big kids of 2017. And I bought this bike for a couple of reasons. One, because it's super fun and I love taking my kids for rides on it. And they, they absolutely love this thing. Because it's small, but it's also made for adults. And you know, it's just a great time all around. But being that a car channel or a customizer like myself just can't leave anything alone. And that was my intention right from the beginning because these are pretty uh, easy to get machine. You can just go to Tractor Supply and pick them up. I think there's many other places that sell them as well. Coleman is a huge company and they make a really nice starting unit as far as I'm concerned. 
and for a price point of about six hundred dollars you really can't go wrong for a fun toy that you can enjoy with your family so being that westy and i are going to be getting in together on a couple of different projects this one is going to be one of those for sure i'm going to be taking the bike over to his shop and we're just going to kind of sit down and look at the bike and think about what we could do to make it better and badder and just like not an out of the box kind of thing and if interest is big enough we might be able to make some of the parts that we're going to create for this bike available to you guys if you have one of these bikes and you want to do the same kind of thing that's all what it's about we're all about sharing we're all about making sure that everybody can have something cool and unique and have the if you don't have the ability to build the parts yourself we might be able to have those available for you to put on your mini bike so that's going to be uh, an amazingly fun project to do i can't wait to do it and uh I guess we're gonna see what happens and what we can turn this really kind of nice starting point into a full custom motorcycle. All right, I think the truck is gonna get a wash today as well because all the snow and everything made a complete mess out of it. But we're at Westy's shop and I'm gonna be giving him a Christmas gift. Seeing it how, as a mechanic, I try to find the one thing that I really use a lot in my truck that isn't maybe the most expensive thing, but it's the most helpful thing. And I try to give those to the people that I know are gonna use it. And I think this stylus Streamlight flashlight is gonna be the one for this year. So we're here to give one to Westy. What's going on? Oh, air ride on Ford. <laughs> Trying to get it done. A lot of Fords around here. Super Duty. Ford's always need fixing. Mustang. You ever heard of anybody doing a Ford motor swap onto a Chevy? No, that's never happened. <laughs> be the first one to do it. Yeah. If you want to be an innovator, yeah. that's the way to go. Merry or Christmas. Fill up, sir. Oh. Streamlight. Oh, yeah. I have a feeling I know where that may have come from. Yeah? <laughs> It did come from Amazon, so just so you know, I will drop a link in the description for this light if you guys want to buy one of those. But uh, mechanics tool of the year, in my opinion. All right, our third prize in the giveaway has been delivered. I can't wait to do another giveaway, so keep building up that subscriber base and getting us to the next point, and I'll keep on doing these giveaways. I love doing them. They're a lot of fun. It helps the channel grow, and the more we grow, the better the prizes get, and that always benefits you guys. So thank you very much for that. And the next two prizes will be delivered very shortly. I can't wait to get those in the mail so the people can receive them. Hopefully we'll get them before Christmas. But thank you again for everybody that made this all possible. It's about as good as it's gonna get. Yeah. <laughs> Another fun job done. Yeah, so much fun, man. I wish I could do one of these every day. So where are we headed now? TSE vehicle accessories to drop it off, get paid. I almost didn't see that red light because it looked like a Christmas tree light. Oh yeah. Well, I mean, red lights and green lights, that's Christmas right. colors. It's just a festive light. Exactly. Why did you go through that red light, sir? It was festive. What red light? It was a Christmas light. It was very festive. <laughs> oh yeah, brother, check out the hog. Oh yeah. That's a pretty sweet bike. With the rake on that one. Got the Hummer H2. The Ranchero. So it's about seven o'clock at night. Todd is the owner here at TSE and he does everything he can to make his customers happy. Stay way late for this guy to get his truck back. And that's just the kind of service that he provides for all of his customers. Westy, how you doing, brother? 
If only you could smell PSE vehicle accessories. Well, <laughs> no doubt. So everybody's going to have to come down here and actually get a, a whiff of what it's like in here. It's yeah. actually pretty amazing. <laughs> smell of success. That's right. <laughs> So he's got stereo equipment, he's got wheels, he's got all kinds of detailing stuff and pretty much anything you're ever going to need and honestly if he doesn't have it here he'll definitely be able to get it for you. So Todd, what do you do here at TSE? Well here at TSE what we do is we do customizing and uh, aftermarket uh, and OE parts for cars and trucks. Uh, we sell wheels, tires, um, and we also do installations and everything we sell and do. My boy Westy from uh, Westy's Speed Shop, he does all my installations and everything, and um, we guarantee our work. Um, and I hope you guys come and check us out, because you won't be disappointed. Absolutely, you heard the man. So, TSE Auto Accessories in Effort of Pennsylvania, definitely come check them out. So, if anybody's wondering what Max does in his free time... You could do it better than that. Oh, how do you like that? Is that how they do it in Russia? Russia. All right, everybody, we got some gifts delivered. Had a good time doing that, and I hope everybody enjoyed the upload. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. We have plenty more to come on Hammerdown Motorsports. Keep that hammer down.